How to Become a Better Person Most people want to improve themselves, whether they are at job, home, or just out running errands. The challenge is knowing where to start. These are a few methods I've been employing to develop myself every day. Consider your words before speaking. The power of words is huge. Think back to the moment your significant other first expressed their love for you. What an amazing sensation that was. However, insults could also be made. Have you ever used an offensive term or cracked a joke around someone? You undoubtedly felt terrible after that. Always think about the consequences of your words before uttering them out for a few seconds. Accept change. Change encourages personal growth. Instead of resisting change, you should be open to trying new things, even if they make you nervous. The newest Thai restaurant in town, for instance, can make you afraid to go, but you might end yourself finding your new favorite. You should encourage positive change in addition to accepting change. You might start a recycling program or a food drive at work, both of which would help your community. Be thankful. A study found that those who keep gratitude journals are often happier and more happy. Talking about thankfulness also lowers envy of the wealthy, boosts willingness to help others, and guards against health problems like coronary artery disease. The right thing to do. You should unquestionably understand the distinction between right and wrong as an adult. Imagine that after taking your dog for a walk, you don't pick up after it. No needs to tell you that it's your responsibility to tidy up the mess. You are aware that it is your duty to take care of it and that it would not be just for someone else to do so. Use your resources. Remember that you were given these skills as a gift. Make sure they aren't wasted. Show off your guitar playing abilities to others. It will appeal to both you and the people in your life. Deal with your weaknesses. Then again, you should be aware of your flaws as well. It's simply another way to encourage our own growth. Make a note of your areas of weakness and create goals to address them. I'm a challenging person to work with. I get it. Learn how to identify your shortcomings and take action to fix them. It's important to look for yourself. Workout, eating healthy, get enough rest. 1,000 times have been said that why say? But one of the best things you can do for your personal growth is to take care of yourself. How? For instance, can you play outside with your children if you are constantly exhausted? If you're worn out, how can you work more productively? Your family, friends, and co-workers will value the happier and more productive you will be as a result. Be a warrior. You don't need to wear tights and a cape to accomplish this. It comprises helping an elderly neighbor buy for groceries, enabling others access purchasing them coffee when the person in front of you has her card declined, hearing a friend discuss a recent split. Be mindful of others. Isn't it wonderful when someone inquires about your day? For others, try to follow suit, even if you have to write down reminders in your calendar. Following up with someone after an important event can mean the world to them. Don't waste your money anymore. The food service industry is concerned about waste. So just because an all-you-can-eat buffet offers five dishes of food doesn't mean you have to. You may use less water overall by taking shorter showers and recycling more. Additionally, keep in mind that unplugging devices while not in use might help you save money on energy, even though it seems small. Your effort can have a significant effect on the environment. Forgive yourself and others. Humans are fallible, even when you are the one who makes the mistake. These mistakes can occasionally be excruciatingly uncomfortable. However, instead of wasting time clinging to that mistake or feeling guilty, forgive that person or yourself and focus on the future. Remember that the best kinds of vengeance are success and happiness because they are so good for your health. Avoid being impatient. We become irritated and may act regrettably when we become impatient. In order to go out the door in the morning or finish an assignment, ask yourself how you would feel if you had yelled at your child or a coworker. You'll make better decisions and feel better about yourself every day if you practice patience. Be yourself. Being authentic can help you stay more focused, develop confidence, create your own personality, and be able to articulate your values and ideas. 
avoid pointing fingers. When you point one finger, there are three fingers pointing back at you, my primary school teacher once said. Everybody faces challenges in life, but you shouldn't let them stop you from improving or from moving forward. Never forget that it is your responsibility to preserve energy. No matter how modest or lofty your objectives may be, stop pointing the finger, whining, and making excuses and start pursuing them instead. Thank you for watching. Peace.